the construction industry, they, they want to, to reduce the rework. They want to reduce mistakes. They, they don't want projects to be late. It's just probably they don't have enough good tools to, uh, to achieve that. The construction industry has always been accused of being slow to react to pick up new technologies, but that is all changing. With the increased digitization of the sector, global visionaries are now embracing future technologies and changing the game from improved build quality and efficiency using augmented reality to promises of a more sustainable future by eliminating rework altogether. This series gets to know the people, the products and the plans whilst demystifying the tech and illuminating the future of what the construction industry looks like. Augmented reality may still be the new kid on the block when it comes to construction technology, but in spite of a few false starts from some early players, AR is now fast becoming a proven industry solution for construction. But for AR to be useful in the sector, it needs to be accurate. And as we're about to find out, not all AR is created equal. We meet up with Pietro Desiato and the team at XYZ Reality to learn what makes the world's most accurate AR for construction. So at XYZ, we always start from the customer and their needs, and we identified a gap in the construction industry, which was around uh, tools not being uh, accurate, and uh, the data coming back to the customer was taking a very long time. Without accuracy, you basically end up with a tool that can make visualization, but uh, cannot really be used to uh, make decisions in a real construction project. We were investigating all the existing AR platforms, and including the HoloLens, and we tried working with the HoloLens for a long time. It is a great bit of kit, but we couldn't get the accuracy required for construction out of the existing devices. But what is AR and construction all about? AR is used to position 3D building models on site in their exact build location in the real world, so construction teams can view and inspect their installs at every phase of the build. Teams can set out directly from the model itself, removing human error from the equation. They can identify potential clashes or issues ahead of time, eliminating future rework and the associated costs. And also validate works after they have been installed, so that if any issues do arise, office teams can see exactly what the issue is on the ground in real time, allowing them to act immediately. If the AR is not accurate, you can't guarantee the building model that you are looking at is in the correct position let alone within construction tolerances. This means that inspections cannot be relied upon nor validated in real time, which is ultimately one of the main benefits of using AR in construction. When we look at construction, we're talking about uh, you know, 15, 10, 5 millimeter uh, accuracy, which is like something that no one else is capable of doing. So the only way of uh, delivering value was to build our own uh, tracking uh, system and device system. We decided basically to implement our own uh, hard hat and software that basically has been specifically designed to solve these problems. Our is the first device with uh, engineering grade accuracy between 3 and 5 mil. All our competitors with the technology they can achieve uh, uh, centimeter if not meters. So uh, they are not, uh, they, they don't have any solution that can be used in the construction industry to eliminate error. Uh, that's why we call it engineering grade AR. It's a reliable and accurate tool that delivers precise data that uh, builders and uh, construction managers can use to uh, take uh, decisions. We have a patented technology that basically allows the user to tap into the site coordinate system for uh, absolute uh, model positioning with millimeter accuracy. All the other technology that you see in the market uh, again, they have been designed for generic purpose. They don't use this kind of system. They use like other technology, like for example, SLAM or uh, computer vision, that at the moment, they are not uh, allowing to have this particular accuracy, this engineering grid accuracy that is essential. One of the biggest benefits of using accurate AR is that engineers and construction managers can validate exactly what is being built in seconds. Being able to act upon the data that you get is critical because otherwise you end up with beautiful pictures or beautiful visualizations that are not really you can't really trust. So we wanted to build something that was built for construction that people can trust to take action that can lead you know to uh, decisions that are very uh, important in terms of budget changes or uh, changing the plan of a project. Uh, uh, they can affect different companies, so business-wise it's quite impactful. So it had to be accurate, it had to be reliable.
Now, for the first time, construction teams can act on the reliable data coming back from the field in real time. Rather than waiting on more traditional and time-consuming reactive processes such as laser scanning, which identify errors once it's too late and the costs have already been incurred, engineering-grade augmented reality allows teams to validate works immediately or even ahead of time, streamline build processes and keep projects on schedule and on budget. We want to enable people to be more productive, so being able to do more in less time, that's what technology is about. And so anything that kind of helps you reduce the time to do a task, to do an inspection, um, is going to be really, really important. If, you, you know, if you're wearing uh, some extra tech, you almost want to have uh, extra powers. For those powers to be realized fully, to be actually useful, uh, it needs to be accurate, otherwise uh, they're not superpowers. The construction industry, they, they want to, to reduce the rework. They want to reduce mistakes. They, they don't want projects to be late. It's just probably they don't have enough good tools to, uh, to achieve that. XYZ is providing uh, that opportunity with the, uh, with the Atom and the uh, engineering grade AI. Should accuracy be a choice? I don't think it should be a choice. If it can be achieved, and we've, I think we've dis demonstrated that with the, uh, with the Atom, uh, then, uh, uh, you know, uh, it's, it's just, uh, it needs to be there. Accuracy itself is kind of like the foundation of trust. New technologies can often seem like a minefield to navigate, so it's vital to choose to follow the data you can trust. If it's not millimetre accurate, it's not engineering grade. And if it's not engineering grade, then it has no place in construction. For improving build accuracy to reducing rework and raising profit margins, Engineering grade augmented reality is here to stay.